Section 9 of My Bible History, Old Testament, by Bishop Morrow. This LibriVox recording is in the public domain. Recording by Maria Therese. The Tower of Babel. Noah had three sons, Sim, Cham, and Japhet. They helped him take care of his vineyard. Once, when the time came to gather the grapes, Noah drunk too much wine, because he did not know its strength. Becoming very drunk, he lay exposed in his tent. Cham saw him. Instead of covering his father, he went laughing to tell his brothers. Sim and Japhet, filled with filial love, went to where Noah slept, and walking backwards covered their father. When Noah awoke and learned what had taken place, he cursed Cham's descendants through Cham's son, Canaan. But he blessed Sim and Japhet. Noah lived for about nine hundred and fifty years. After his death, many of his descendants forgot God. They became proud and ungrateful. They were so numerous that many families had to move to distant lands, but before separating, they resolved in their pride to build a city and tower that would reach up to heaven. Their pride was quickly punished. God confounded their speech, that is, he made them talk in different languages. Before that time they had only one language. Now they could not understand each other. This is why the tower was called Babel, because of the confusion of tongues. Giving up their plan of the tower, which they had already started, the builders scattered all over the earth. The descendants of Sem, from whom the Israelites sprang, spread over the greater part of Asia. Those of Cham settled in Africa, while those of Japhet passed over to Europe. In their wanderings, the foolish workmen of Babel carried with them a remembrance of the flood and of the existence of a supreme being. This is why, even among uncivilized tribes, we find the tradition of these beliefs however distorted by ignorance and superstition. Babel, a monument of pride, destroyed the unity of language. Unbelief or heresy, the result of pride, destroys the unity of faith. Let us ever guard against pride. End of section 9